Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to create a simple wobble base on Massive VST on FL Studio 10. This is what I made about 10 minutes ago, it's just simple and it's not that hard to make really. Here it is. Uh, I'm going to show you how to make that. Um, you go new, well, I've, I always go empty template and then you go well I don't want to save it so I go there to make the first one you go insert or replace and then you go to massive I always put it if I got a demo so it's gonna be a bit funny I always put it to screamer but today I'm gonna put it at multiplex because I tried that and it sounded pretty good you put the pitch down minus 20 to 26 so I put it in between 24 and then I choose the filter one as a screen and you put this thing all the way up um, after that all I do is just go F LFO, 5 LFO you go sync rate I'm going to put it on 12 because that's what I want to put it at and you can change it if you want it just changes the speed so I just drag mine into the first minus box of the cutoff drag the 5 all the way down and put the knob all the way up and then it should sound like that that's my first one the second one is I'm going to insert another massive and I'm going to do exactly the same but leave the 5 LFO at a different rate so I'm going to put it back to multiplex filter scream 5 LFO and I'm going to put it on a sync of 8 and I'm going to drag that and do exactly the same put it into the first minus drag all the way down put all the way up and that's that and now I need to make my tune so I'm going to the first one is a slower beat, which I want to go on the second bit. So the first one is that. I want to make that eight beats. Eight beats, so I'm going to put it all the way down to number three. And the second one, which the second one, which is a different speed, I'm going to put after three, but I'm going to make that four beats. And then I'm gonna make a one above it. So that's there. And then it should sound like this. If you want to make it sound a bit different, you can use different hip hops. I use hip hops because they're better for dubstep producing and stuff like that I'll drag them in there and create a little bit now because those are a bit loud put it down a bit and put volumes of the samples all the way up so it's going to sound a bit like this I forgot to put it on repeat there so you just click this button here and that repeats the whole pattern line over and over again so you don't have to keep playing it that's my tutorial on how to make a simple massive bass using multiplex and scream on massive Thanks for watching. Keep what uh, subscribe and everything, because I'm gonna keep making more on Massive and probably Vanguard as well. Thank you. Bye.